Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make paracord bracelets. So these are so easy to make once you get the hang of them and you'll just want to make them every day. And you can get so many different colors off of like Amazon or a craft store and they're super cute and fun to wear. Okay, so first you'll need some clips. It really doesn't matter what size they are. I just have the smaller ones. Need scissors, a ruler or a mat with measurements on it, and eight feet of paracord. So now you can measure out eight feet of paracord. So you're just going to take from one end of the ruler to the other and then or you can use your mat and then you're just gonna measure out eight of these okay so now that you've measured out eight feet you can just untangle it you just wanted to make sure that you have enough all right so now you're gonna make sure that your tips are aligned the same and then you're just gonna straighten it out a little make sure it doesn't tangle and so now you're gonna take this part of the clip and you're gonna take this end of the paracord and you're gonna put it through the top see how it's kind of like curved there you're gonna put it through the top pull it out a little and push these two through here and pull them out and just pull. So basically it's just a big huge knot. So now you're gonna kind of like take this a little tightly but not so it hurts and you're gonna go to the other end. It's okay if it's a little uneven. So now you're gonna take your other clip and again have it curved like this and you're going to put it through the top and then you're just kind of going to pull pretty far down making sure that it doesn't like twist up and then you're going to measure the person's wrist that you're doing it for and this part over here you can just like push there and you can kind of just clip it on and make sure it's like bigger because you're going to have a lot of stuff. So see how if you like pull it regular, it's that much. So that's perfect. So now you're going to start your bracelet. You are going to take this one over here make sure that's like this and you're just gonna hold it like this so then you take for that you're holding in your right hand and you're gonna go over to these two right here and under this one and then you can kind of just pull that to the side and then you take this one over here on this side and pull it under all of them and through this loop over here and then you just slowly tighten it and make sure it's really tight, otherwise it won't stay. Okay, so now you're going to take the um, person's wrist and make sure it's good. So then you just kind of clip it and make sure when you pull it, it's about the same as you had it before. So now we can... Go ahead and do the next step. So now instead of going over and under, you're going to go under these two and over this one. And then you're going to pull that to the side. Then with the one on your left hand, you're going to go over the two and through here. And then just tighten it very tightly and kind of like move it up and tighten it more. As you can tell, you can already see it forming like a little zigzag pattern. That is what you want. 
and then you repeat those same steps. Just to recap, I'm going to do it one more time. So go over these two and under this one with the one from your right. And then with the string on the left, you're going to come underneath through here and go through there. And then tighten. And now you're going to go under over this one and move that to the side. And then you're going to take this from your left hand and go over and through. Okay, so then again, you just did those two steps through the whole bracelet, and now you're just going to finish it. So you go over two, under this one, under these, and through, and then under these two, over this one, and over these, and through. And then you could just like pull. So then you can do like one more there. So you're gonna go over, under, under, and through. And then push it up a little so you can get one more in there. And then under, over, over, and Your last one's probably going to be the hardest. But that's okay. So then for this next part, you're probably going to want a parent to do it. Especially with younger people. So you're going to have to take a lighter and light it. That's why you need a parent. So now you're going to take your scissors. And you're going to cut pretty closely to the edge of the bracelet. And you cut the other side. Being careful not to cut the bracelet. So then you're going to light the ends of both of these so it doesn't unravel on you. So then you're going to have a pair of or if you're old enough, you can do it on your own. You're going to melt it until it's, like, stuck and hard so it doesn't unravel on you. So then you can kind of, like, take it and bend it into place. So it's kind of, like, rounded on the top. So it fits the wrist. So now I can just put it on the wrist. And it's a really cute and stylish bracelet that you can wear <laughs> all the time. Hope you guys enjoyed my video on how to make paracord bracelets. See you next time. Bye.